don't want my doctor to bring up a c-section welcome to another baby watch vlog so today is baby watch vlog number five I think so I just want to say welcome to today's vlog so I am starting off sitting down and we are just tired I just finished putting myself together I usually don't get myself together at all especially when my husband isn't here because I'm not really doing much but since I am starting the vlog I just really wanted to feel put together before I started it so that is what I am doing um, the kids are back there in the room just playing and doing things like that I have a to-do list today and also some things that I wanted to talk to you guys about so I am going to start this vlog off um, a little bit of chit chatty uh, because I just want to say this um, if I do not post it does not mean that I'm in labor I have a I'm in labor video already edited and set it's just in my private it. so if I go into labor you guys will see that video first if I'm not posting that's because nothing has happened nothing has changed nothing is going on I know it sounds chaotic back there but they're playing uh, but I did want to say that if I am not posting it does not mean that I'm in labor it just means that nothing has happened and I have nothing to update you guys on at all and also I am loving doing these baby watch vlogs because I feel like they are way more realistic than day in the life like day in the life you kind of have to show and pull here and there with these vlogs I'm just picking up the camera and sharing whatever it is that I feel like I want to share so I am so happy for that and thank you guys so much for your support I cannot Thank you guys enough for your support on my YouTube channel right now. It is just amazing to see. But I, like I said, I do have a to-do list. I am going to share that with you guys now. And I'm going to eat breakfast because I haven't. And it is already, it is already 1047. So I have not eaten breakfast at all. Today, my goal is to pretty much just clean this house up. I want this house squeaky clean, especially considering that I I could go into labor at any point in time oh and today we make 36 weeks you guys so I am 36 weeks today I am so excited my symptoms right now uh, starting off is I am contracting um, I've been contracting all morning for contractions so as of right now I am just relaxing but like I said I want this house to be squeaky clean before I go into labor which could be tonight which could be tomorrow which could be next week uh, so realistically speaking I want this house squeaky clean and I have uh, my tripod that my kids had which is broken my shoe that my kids brought out of the room socks I have kids shoes clothes from being changed this morning shoes over here all kinds of stuff so and I have boxes on the TV stand I am just trying to see just things that I need to do basically today will be kind of like a preparing the house for baby video uh, well preparing the house for baby vlog I just need to get everything like situated the kitchen is not too bad I do want to eat first um, because I haven't eaten anything and doing something on an empty stomach while you're pregnant is just not it so I'm about to go fix me some cereal and then I'm gonna come back and sit down and eat and then we are gonna tackle this living room watch vlog is something I've already done so I can go ahead and mark that off the list get house squeaky clean that is something that we're gonna be doing um, washing and folding laundry laundry is like up to my neck at this point so I really need to get on laundry today um, put items that I need in my hospital bag so pretty much I have shirts that I wash in the laundry that I need to add to my hospital bag and that's pretty much it 
um i need to do 20 minutes on my birth ball so i'm gonna be bouncing on my birth ball today which i'm so excited for um finish up baby boy's ba bathing station so i started that in one of my vlogs and i kind of need to go ahead and finish it because i want to have this stuff that needs to go in the bathroom in the bathroom once we get home i need to get my water intake up and then take out the kids clothes and put them out for my mother-in-law so Felt I'm done with the defense Throw back and climb over your fence Hide to show, show you that I was a mess So you were shrugging your shoulders I'm closed off, that's what I told you Soon enough, everything started to change Alright you guys, this is what I am having for breakfast it is just captain crunch which i absolutely love right now so this is what i'm going to be eating and then i'm going to clean up the living room so as y'all can see i am contracting i am contracting and you know that could be a good thing um but i am not going to stop what i am doing today i'm going to continue to get things done i need to clean this house up i'm contracting so i am monitoring my contractions now um considering that i've been contracting all morning i'm gonna go ahead and monitor them and just track them so anytime i have one i will be putting it on my phone so the app that i actually have is called a contraction timer um, it is green and it looks like this when you open it um, just looks like that so as you guys can see my contractions are just lasting like they vary they're very short and brief which is something new um, usually they are a minute but they're actually brief pretty brief um, so one was 21 22 seconds and one was 47 seconds and then they are six minutes apart so we're gonna see if we keep that trend of some seconds seconds and six minutes apart if we do then i may call my ob if we don't then that's fine i bet you think that i should calm down and that i'm overthinking everything about you and that we're good the way we are So what I'm gonna do, <laughs> I know I should probably just sit down, but if my husband, my husband said he is actually gonna come home and help me. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna finish sweeping that up and I'm going to get this stuff off of this TV stand that way and also get this stuff off the couch over there. So that way the living room will be clean and all my husband will have to do when he comes home is um, get the dining room table clean and the kitchen. And I'm gonna throw those waters and stuff away over there. I haven't had one since sitting here. So you don't let me go When I come real close I don't want to get hurt Cause I'm not ready To give you my heart yet Before I'm too invested I should probably ask ya Ask you all my questions Get to know you better But can you be trusted? Will you take me for granted?
Okay guys, so what is happening right now is I am currently having contractions. Um, they are, wasn't painful this morning, but you do have to stop and kind of like breathe. And then I have been, this one that I just recently had that you guys just seen, actually radiated in my back. So what I think I'm gonna do, since my husband is not close, is I'm probably just gonna sit down and relax and just wait until he get home and resume the video so i know he will be here if i need to go to the hospital because <sighs> these contractions are eight minutes apart right now and the last one lasted a minute but the average duration of them are 56 seconds so we are almost to a minute and they're eight minutes apart so that's fairly close um they could be, it could be because i'm moving around but also i'm feeling leaking in so today I may just go to the hospital and get checked out and I'm gonna bring you guys along if I do but right now I'm just contracting and they are getting to the point where they are actually pretty like I said I'm having them in my back and it could be back labor so I don't want to keep pushing myself I was just sweeping over there sweeping and getting that stuff up over there the living room is pretty much clean i want to like i said wait until my husband is a little bit closer so we will see we will see i hope i wait i'm put up with changes come pick me up because i just want to see the light i want to be weightless teach me to fly i won't be coming down could somebody wake me up? I don't wanna be here and let the world pass me by yeah. I just see her face where Ever I look, she's standing in the crowd So I let go, let go I don't want to, but I'm gonna try When she left me, yeah Let a little bit inside, you know, you know Maybe things are gonna Okay so I just sat down. I just went to the bathroom and used the bathroom just to make sure the contractions was not coming from my bladder being full because if you have a full bladder, then um, most of the time you will contract because your bladder isn't empty. So I went back there, emptied my bladder. It was not a lot. And I'm actually having like pressure downstairs. So I don't know what's happening or whatever the case is I am done with this contraction that I just had and they are eight minutes apart consistently so I may be in labor right now um I don't know right now I do not know but I'm gonna edit this video um I don't think I'm gonna do anything else until my husband gets home and that won't be till 12 36 and it's 11 58 I didn't expect this baby watch vlog to go like this but I am contracting my contractions are eight minutes apart and almost lasting a minute um, we are at 59 seconds so they are almost lasting a minute and like I said I was not expecting this vlog to go like this baby boy is moving so so that's good but he's not moving as much as what he usually do this morning he was kicking up a storm right now he's just kind of like relaxing I was supposed to do a lot more things I need to I need to do these things because they are like one has something to do with my hospital bag and the other has stuff something to do with putting the hospital bags over there I was gonna bounce on my bulb <laughs> I think I need the knot right now. I'm just gonna be relaxing right here, and I'm probably gonna start editing this baby watch vlog so I can put this up. Um, I don't know how long it's gonna be, it's probably very short. <laughs> I did a lot of 
okay y'all so this is my husband's hospital bag i'm gonna go through and just fold everything because the way he got everything just thrown in here it's not gonna work never thought it would be so hard i grew up without a scar just living my life with no big worries and i've always known what i want just didn't know what came along Finding myself a much less happy Back in the days I used to dream about one day A life so amazing Not everyone judging me 